Hey, what's going on everybody? Welcome back. So today I'm going to show you guys how you can install Kodi on any platform, whether you're on Android, uh, Windows, or Fire TV Sticks. Now, before we get into it, some of you guys may be asking if it's even legal to use Kodi. Uh, while it's completely legal to use Kodi, some of the add-ons that are used for Kodi can offer links to copyrighted content. So to make sure that you don't get accidentally blocked by your ISP, make sure that you're using a good VPN so that your internet service provider won't be able to know what you're doing online so that you can maintain your anonymity and avoid any potential headaches by downloading the wrong content. And of course, a VPN is not only useful for keeping your data private while you're browsing or while you're streaming, but it's also very useful for accessing content that may not be available to you. And that does include streaming content or content that you may be torrenting. But again, always make sure that you remain within the bounds of the law, no matter where you are. But of course, a VPN will always make things easier and much more secure. So if you guys are interested in any of those, you'll find them in the description down below. Now, getting into how to install Kodi, it's actually compatible with multiple home devices, including your smartphones, Android TV, Fire Stick, PC, Smart TV, and more. And of course, you can install Kodi on multiple platforms like Windows, Android, iOS, and Mac OS, even TV OS, Raspberry Pi, and Linux. Now, to install it on your Android, just open the Play Store or on the search bar, type Kodi, select the top Kodi result by Kodi Foundation and click install. And this will then download and install the application automatically. And just open when it's finished to use Kodi. Now, the way you install it on a Fire Stick is a little different. And the reason that it's different is because unlike Android, Amazon doesn't have official support for the Kodi app. So you have to sideload the APK file and do a manual install. Don't worry, it's pretty easy. Just go to your home screen on your Fire Stick, navigate to settings and select My Fire TV. Go to developer options, enable ADB debugging and also allow apps from unknown sources. And to download the file, you must have a downloader app readily available on the Amazon store. If you don't have it, go back to the home screen under find, select search and type downloader. Click on the first choice orange app named downloader and then click get to download and install downloader into your Fire Stick. After the installation, open up the app and download and install the Kodi app. Just navigate to the URL field of the application and type this link and click go. After the download process is done, which takes a few seconds, the installation will begin. Once it's done, you can open up Kodi and customize it to your liking. Now, if you're looking to install it on your Windows, first you can choose to download the Kodi app instantly from the Microsoft Store, or you can download it through the official Kodi website. I prefer to download it through the website, so just go to the official website and select Windows. Download the correct version for your PC, whether 32-bit or 64-bit, and then proceed to installation. And it's basically the same procedure for macOS as well, but on the website, just select macOS. And that's basically how you can install Kodi on your Android, your Fire Stick, and your Windows. If there are any other devices that you have in mind and you'd like a tutorial for, then you can let us know in the comments down below. And again, make sure that you're always protected when you're using Kodi and downloading the add-ons, because again, a lot of these add-ons could have copyrighted content, and you wanna make sure that you're always protected by using a VPN. Not to mention that by using a VPN, you can access all kinds of streaming services, uh, whether it's Hulu, uh, Disney+, Plus, HBO Max, all kinds of Netflix libraries and Amazon Prime libraries, no matter your location. Just select the correct location on the VPN and you should be good to go. So again, you'll find the links to pricing discounts as well as full reviews to these VPNs, whether it's Express Nord or Surfshark, in the description down below. And like and subscribe if you'd like to support the channel and stay up to date with future videos. Thank you guys very much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Have a wonderful day.